A break in a West Melbourne apartment ended when police say the homeowner shooting at intruders and killing one of them. That home invasion happened early Sunday morning. Number four Bureau Chief Scott Heidler spoke with people living at that complex. Several residents of reserves at Melbourne apartment complex say the shooting happened around 2 a.m. Sunday. Police cars screaming in. God only knows what they were doing, you know. But this is a nice development. It's usually very quiet and everybody watches out for each other. So I hope they do something to make sure it doesn't happen anymore. Another resident who didn't want to be on camera told us that the apartment complex is family friendly. Nothing like this has happened in the years he has lived there. According to the West Melbourne Police, multiple people, possibly armed, forced their way into one of the apartment units. It was then that the homeowner opened fire with their weapon, firing multiple times, hitting two of the intruders. One was pronounced dead at Holmes Regional Medical Center. The other showed up at a hospital and is being treated. I'm against guns. You know, I think we really seriously need to take a look at it, and we're not. So, you know, I just stay close to home, stay out of the way. Other neighbors told us this intrusion shows the importance of gun ownership. When we asked the state attorney's office on charges related to the shooting at this early stage of the investigation, they're referring all questions here to the West Melbourne Police Department. The police say that this is an ongoing investigation. They're working to determine what led up to the home invasion and if there was any relationship between those involved. In West Melbourne, Scott Heidler, West 2 News.